So what's going on everyone? My name is Hunters World Gaming. Welcome back to more of the Pingu.exe games. This one is the latest one that Nicole D. Ray has made. It's called Sad Pingu? What the frick? Let me check that one out. Okay, this is Pingu's Sadness. Basically, it's a sequel to the last previous Pingu horror game that we played before by Nicola D. Ray and the other developer, Pingu is so sad now. It, it is too late. Oh, really, huh? <laughs> well, as you can tell, this is a second Pingu indie horror game we're getting now from Nicola D. Ray. So anyway, with that, let's play. Uh, oh, what the hell? Okay. Well, let's see. Before playing, we need to read this note. Hello, everyone. I make a new Pingu indie horror game. Engine is made by Khaled Yellow the, Hedge the Hedgehog. Link in the description. Wow, okay. Hope you enjoy this game. Can I extract it all before we do anything? I'm sure we can. Extract all the files when complete. Sure, why not? Okay, then. Then that's out of the way. Let's start. Shit. Never expected it to play another sequel to a Pingu horror game. All right. Let's do it, guys. Okay. Oh, I like this new logo with Mario hat and gumball in the background. Engine user, the Pingu engine. Very cool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, I really love this Pingu engine right there. Oh my god. God, I played those first two games. Like, the first two versions. One by the developer, which I don't know who that was. I forgot the name. And the other was made by Nicola D. Raven before. Or probably Splixer the Gamer. I think he's the one who made the other version of it. But this is Sadness Pingu. Oh my goodness. Let's do this. Alright, so we play as Pingu in the house. Okay, now let's take a stroll inside of the house, guys. Going outside, out of the igloo. And we're going on this beautiful Arctic Circle adventure. Yes! God, I really love these indie horror games. With Pingu in it, what the fuck? Man, it's gonna be like Suicide Mouse as we, as we progress. Very cool. Very, 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 very cool. It came out in September 28, 2022. Just like two days before Hocus Pocus 2 came out, then I definitely watched Hocus Pocus 2. That one was one of my favorite movies with the returning of the Sanderson sisters. Oh my goodness. If you have watched Hocus Pocus 2 before, let us know in the comment section below. If you watched it, or if you haven't watched it yet, please make sure to watch the very first one from 1993 before you start watching the second sequel to Hocus Pocus in 2022, which is this year on Disney+. Plus. So that's good. Why do we... Ha oh, this is ice fishing. This is ice fishing as shit. Oh, goodness. Let me move my mouse to the corner. There we go. Okay. What are we doing? We're meeting Pinga? I know Pinga is somewhere. I don't know if we're getting Pinga or... Oh, no, it changed to black. Okay. How is that so amazing? I am so really sad. Why are you so really sad, huh? Is it aesthetic like the same thing from Five Nights at Freddy's? Oh my god, what the frick? Pingu Sekai de Ichiban Genki na Pinguin.exe is crashing. Please restart the game. It's not over. It's not over. Oh my god. This is gonna be another fourth wall breaking shit, eh? Okay, let me restart the game again. Oh! Uh, excuse me? Your eyeballs are gone? What the frick? <gasps> it only said Pingu, but there's no trademark anymore in there. Oh my god! It's too late for me? What is it too late for you? What happened there? Are you sad or is it like Suicide Mouse? Oh my fucking god. Look at the entire Arctic Circle. It's all bloody snow all over the place. The igloo, the snowman, the glaciers, the ice. And Pingu is so sad. Look at the tears streaming down his face. Where's Pinga? 
Where's his friends? Oh my god. Good thing he's not even killing them. Which isn't the same thing as this. Oh my god. This is too horrifying. When my mouse to a side, Jesus. Okay, I don't know why this reopened by itself out of nowhere. I, I, I just like double clicked on it and it just popped up out of nowhere. Oh my god. It's too late for me. Oh, uh, with the letter A? Why does it have like the purple color shape thing in the middle of the letter A? Really weird. Yeah, the same paragraph said at the at the black screen right there before it before we spawn here back to this area but with so many blood all around the place and even the fish eyes are gone in the in the sign what the fuck what happened to your eyes mister okay i'm sure we're walking so slow and the music is so distorted very demonic and slow what the fuck Oh my god, this really looks different than the previous Pingu Indie Horror games I played. This is like a different storyline, isn't it? Leave me alone. Leave you alone? Well, I wish I could leave you alone. Okay, there you are, Pingu, standing there in the blackness, staring right into my soul. You're so creepy, Germa. Oh, how does it know my name? Hi. Look behind you. Ah! Ah! What the fuck? What are you talking about? Ah, spit. I hate spit coming through my mouth. What the fuck? All right, well, what's gonna... Okay. Give up? Give up what? His face is gone. Of course the game closed on its own. Okay, is it, is it even want me to open the game back up again? It said give up. Okay. Oh, it starts from the beginning again. Okay. Yeah, it starts from the beginning again. Yeah, that last jump scare at the end was pretty obvious. What the frick? Okay. Anyway, guys, that was Pingu Sadness. Oh my goodness. I did not even know Nicole and Ray has me the game. What the frick? Oh my god. The storyline looks different. And all the blood splatters are all, all over the place. What the frick? Okay, guys. Pingu Sadness. There you go. Oh my god. Another Pingu Indie Horror game. That we're getting now from Game Jolt. Oh my goodness. Anyway, that's all for today. Uh, there's actually Blitzer the Gamer.exe Nickelodeon Ray Edition. And I'll try to pick that one up pretty soon in the next video. If you really enjoyed, give us your thumbs up. Stay 100% cooler. Be ready for the real action. We will see you then. Bye bye.